Hi, this is Miriam Castilla and welcome to the Manifesting Playground for Soulful Women in Business, where we practice the art and science of effectology, marrying the magical with the practical so you can have more money and more time the easy way without all the hustle. Right, let's talk about the key to achieving work-life balance. So particularly if you're in business, your own business, and if you're a woman, and you have some kids and maybe a partner to boot, then you will probably be constantly chasing and wishing that you could reach this holy grail of work-life balance, this utopian place where you're on top of it all, work's getting done, life is being managed, and you still manage to leave the house with hair and makeup intact. And trust me, I put hair and makeup on just to record these videos. I don't always look like this, so I totally know where you're coming from. And here's what I've learned over the years about work-life balance. It doesn't actually exist. There is no such thing as everything being in perfect balance, especially if you're in business and especially if you're a woman. But there is such a thing as achieving balance within, as achieving a place where you feel balanced, where you feel centered, where you feel like everything is working itself out. And yep, sometimes there are little emergencies and sometimes the unexpected happens, but you retain your center, you retain your balance. And that is the true meaning of work-life balance. Because you know what? There is no real separation between you, work and life. It is all the same thing, especially when you're in business for yourself. Your business is your life. Your business is an integral part of you. You can't separate it. You can't divide your time up. You can't divide your portion, your, your portions of time, your energy, and what's available up between work and life. It is all one. It is all part of you. And ultimately, that is actually the place you want to get to, where you're completely integrated and balanced. And whether you're working or spending time with your children, it still lights you up and it fulfills you. The key is to actually put yourself first and to make sure that you feel balanced and in alignment. That is the key to then managing everything that you're having to manage on the outside of you. And look, I know that sometimes you just got to get shit done and get back on top of things. And if that's what you need a hand with right now, because before you can even start thinking about you know, going to your yoga class or doing your morning meditation and your brain is just stuck on, but I just need to get on top of these three, four, five or a million things. I urge you to pick just five maximum of the most important things and grab yourself a copy of my effectiveness book. It'll take you through the top tips and tricks I know for getting more done in less time and staying sane in the process. It's a bit of a band-aid to be honest because the key to actually then achieving that state of balance, like I just said, is for you to actually get in alignment. But sometimes we just need to get some stuff done, then get in alignment, then get some more stuff done. Okay, so if you need that, please grab it from the link in the description. And until I see you next time, keep on embracing your beautiful and unlimited potential. Bye for now.